Jonathan Major's career has been gaining momentum. The Yale-educated actor played one of Marvel's latest characters, Kang the Conqueror. I'm the man who can give you the one thing you want. And was set to star in his own franchise for the brand. That plan now on hold as Majors faces assault charges by former girlfriend Grace Jabari. Police arrested the actor in March after Jabari called 911. Prosecutors say Majors twisted her arm behind her back, struck her in the head, even pushed her into a vehicle. Majors denies these allegations. Jury selection was held today in Manhattan and six jurors are now impaneled. We were joined earlier by legal analyst and former Manhattan prosecutor, Beth Karras. Beth, thanks so much uh, for taking the time. First, just lay out what Majors is facing here. He's facing seven different A misdemeanor charges. They're all assault or aggravated harassment from stemming from one incident. What you have to do in New York is break down by count all the allegations of, say, the injury. And so there's three different acts that allegedly caused injury. Grabbed her hand and caused injury, grabbed her neck, slapped her in the face and caught her behind the ear. Three different acts this one day in March 2023. So uh, those are the intentional assaults. He's charged with also reckless assault, same conduct, engaging in conduct that would cause injury, but he didn't intend it. And he's also charged with aggravated harassment. He's charged with uh, attempted assault. I mean, the yeah. DA has covered all her bases so that almost any scenario the jury could come up with, it doesn't look good for him. Depending on what they decide to go with and the jury convicts, what could he face what kind of time? He faces up to a year in jail. That would be Rikers Island in New York. That's for the A misdemeanor. If it's a lesser B misdemeanor, that's up to 90 days. But he could also get a probationary sentence and a fine. It's not mandatory jail time. It's not prison. Prison is state prison for a right. felony. This would be a jail, but Rikers Island is no cakewalk. No, no. So opening statements expected Monday, but we've gotten a little bit of a glimpse into what Majors is saying, you know, happened the night in question in a complaint he filed against Jabari. Tell us about that. Yeah, now he files a complaint, but he waited months to do it, and the DA decided not to go forward with it, saying there is no merit to it. What did he but this was This is a cross complaint. He says that basically she's responsible for whatever happened, but we don't know details of it. And the prosecutor says mm, there is just no merit to it. We do know through jury selection that a couple people did not make it onto the jury because they said they have in their heads that video of her dancing two hours after she's assaulted by him. So there's evidence that helps both sides in this case. And jurors, uh, you know, these are messy. You know, cross complaints and domestic situations can be very messy and hard for um, jurors to try to figure out, like, who's really at fault here? No one can think about this trial and not think about uh, Amber Heard and Johnny Depp. I'm wondering, do you think the prosecution learned anything from that case in terms of the charges they're laying out here? You know, the accuser has to be likable by this jury. I mean, if jurors are looking for a reason to let majors go, they're going to blame it. They're going like, to be hard on her, right? So they've got to make sure she comes forward through like straightforward, unemotional, say it like it is. She's, you know, reported it immediately. But there was some evidence, apparently, that she was texting not long after, saying, I know it was my fault. We, we know victims will do this. Right. It was my fault. I provoked this. You know, that she maybe didn't want this to happen to him. But once you start the wheels of justice in motion, which happened that night, you know, she doesn't call the shots anymore. Do you think there's any chance of a plea here, or this goes to the jury? I don't think so. Not at this late date. And I'm sure the DA's office isn't going to give anything less than an A misdemeanor. And that would have a detrimental effect on his career. There's still a chance that six jurors here could come up with a compromise, lesser charge, even a, a violation, which is under a crime, a harassment, which is not a crime, or uh, that they'll let them go all together and say, you know what, they both did something wrong. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.